So what's the deal with all the real world animals that appear in the Pokemon universe? I think the first time I thought about this was when I was a kid and I saw that on the Weepin' Bell in the jungle trading card set, there is a real bird sitting on top of the Weepin' Bell. And I freaked out because I was like, wait, is that a Pokemon I haven't heard of? Because it just looks like a bird. There's plenty more examples of real animals appearing on the trading cards as well. Sitting next to Oddish, there's a frog, and sitting next to Executor, there's a real crab, and the list goes on and on. In the TV show as well, we see lots of real animals. In one of the first episodes, we see a Pidgeotto eating a worm, and in lots of episodes, we see so many freaking fish. Now, I'm not going to point out every single time they reference a real animal in the TV show, but there's a link to a video in the description below where you see plenty more times when real animals show up. So we definitely know that real animals exist in the Pokemon universe, but my question is, how? It's mentioned in several places that Mew is the ancestor of all Pokemon and it has the DNA of all Pokemon that exist. Now that's not to say that Mew was the first ever Pokemon, it's just that Mew is the Pokemon that most other Pokemon originally came from. In the same way that life on Earth here all came from organisms living in the ocean thousands of years ago. In fact, it's even believed that humans in the Pokemon universe evolved from Mew as well. If you want to learn more about how time, space, and all of life was possibly created in the Pokemon universe, check out this video by Bird Keeper Toby, where you get a pretty extensive timeline of which Pokemon are gods and which Pokemon created what. So there are some Pokemon that aren't quite natural. They were created by people or they came from space. But let's ignore them for a moment and imagine that all natural Pokemon did actually evolve from Mew. Did the animals that exist in the Pokemon universe evolve from Mew as well? Many Pokemon are described by comparing them to their real world counterparts. So Pikachu is an electric mouse and Caterpie is often described as a worm. Pidgeotto is a bird, Caterpie is a worm. Birds eat worms, Mr. Pokemon Master! So not only do worms exist, but so do worm-type Pokemon. Somewhere in this Darwinian evolutionary chain, some creatures evolved into mighty Pokemon, while some evolved into puny little animals. So I guess my main question is, in the Pokemon universe, what's the difference between a Pokemon and an animal? You can catch a Caterpie in a Pokeball, but would you be able to catch a worm in a Pokeball? I don't really have a great theory for this. Perhaps I'm wrong. Perhaps animals and Pokemon did not evolve side by side. Maybe animals were there before Pokemon, or maybe Pokemon were there before animals. Maybe Pokemon and animals aren't related at all. They just happen to look like each other. Or maybe, I don't know, maybe a wizard did it? Magic, maybe? Please jump in the comments and uh, give me your theories on this topic. Give this video a like and subscribe because I'm hoping to release some more uh, Pokemon theories in the future. Thank you for watching. I'm out.